hello everyone welcome to part 196 of advanced ecom series in laravel 8 so we are going to continue working on the e-commerce features and uh, see uh, these are the pending points and we have recently done this social share script so we can move this point to the done points as well okay so let's move it and let's see the next point that is the time zone date and time setting okay so we are going to work on this point uh so uh what is the time zone exactly uh why we require to set the time zone for our e-commerce website uh so see uh here whenever some user comes into the website or whenever some order get placed here uh it uh, the website is registering the utc time zone okay you can see here whenever you will uh open any of the table uh, and then you can see the created at and updated at time is working according to the UTC time zone. See, whenever uh, some there will be some entry in any of the table, we are storing the time, uh, date and time in our Laravel e-commerce website. In any Laravel website, we are going to uh, have these two tables, uh, sorry, these two columns created at and updated at. And we are going to store the values as per the global time zone that is the utc okay universal time zone okay we can call you universal time zone and i will show you that it's in app.php file uh, here you can see in app.php file oh sorry not this one app.php file under config okay under config you can see uh, where uh, uh, app debug mode is also there and you can see the time zone is also there so here you can see it's the utc time zone utc means universal time zone that is the global time zone for for the whole world okay so every time if i register the user from my website uh, you can see there is the different time zone uh, time zone is not uh, according to my country time zone see my country is india so uh, whenever i register here uh, so uh, current day time will not come uh, it will pick some other day time that it will pick from the universal uh, global day time but it's not correct we need to set our own time zone otherwise uh, we will get confused user will get confused everyone will get confused okay so that is no, not like if our website belongs to india if most of the sale if our sale target is from india then we need to set the india time zone if uh, our uh, sale target is from pakistan then we must set the pakistan time zone if it is from europe then you we must set from europe time zone if it is from usa then we must set from us time zone okay so we must set the time zone as per our own country okay so let's see first of all i'm going to register one user so that you will come to know better see the current date and time here check it it's 29th august 8 56 am and uh, see uh, what time zone uh, what date and time it will uh, store if i will not uh, uh, change time and uh, see it's currently utc time zone so i'm going to see that what is the difference uh, that will come in utc time zone so i'm going to register one account here in my website so i will pick any uh, email id your email email id one two three one two three four five six okay i will click, click on create your account so i will uh, browse here uh, see okay so account has been uh, created so i'm going to check here the entry uh, i'm going to click on browse here and we'll see 14th entry has come and see the time here see you can see the time is different the time is something other the, this is some other time it's the 326 so uh, see current time is 857 and it is showing the 327 you can say uh because uh, at that time yeah, it must be 856 okay so it is almost uh, six uh, hours behind okay so it is almost to see uh around five six hours behind so it is not updating the current time 
current time in India is 9 a.m. around 9 a.m. but it is picking the current time as 3 30 a.m. so uh, there is a difference of uh, 5.3 okay so five and a half hour of difference so there is the difference here and you can see it is picking the UTS uh, UTC time zone global time zone but we want to convert it to India time zone if our website belongs to India then if the entry comes at 9 a.m. then it must show the 9 a.m. okay 9 a.m. of 29th August okay so let's do this task there are two ways to do this task one is to simply update the time zone here of your complete website okay so this is the simplest way here you can check the list of php time zones uh, php time zone list uh, is available on net and you can simply open this list and open your time zone like if my country is india i will open the asia continent and in that i will uh, i know that my time zone is asia kolkata you know your time zone is that much okay you have the idea okay otherwise you can search that which time zone uh, in google itself that uh, time zone of your country see this is the time zone of my country i can simply copy this time zone and will paste here and then it will start uh, it will start giving date time of my country of india okay like if my country is not india in case if my country is uh, in europe uh, continent and if my country is from UK uh, in London if uh, uh, from England and city is London or uh, anywhere from England okay so I can simply pick this one Europe London so I can simply paste it here okay so so uh, the time zone we need to select our own time zone of, of our country time zone where our website is placed where uh, you are going to belong where from where the traffic is coming okay so uh, uh, so we just require to enter our own country time zone so here I'm going to place Asia Kolkata now I'm going to uh, have that new entry once again so uh, let's do one more entry and this time you can see it's 9 a.m. here 29th August around 9 a.m. so let's see the same time will go there let's see that any email id you can set one two three four five six let's create your account and now we will check in our table here click on browse and you can see here that it's 9 a.m okay you can see here i will uh, just do that for you see it's 9 a.m and 47 second of the 9 a.m okay so it's 9 a.m 29th august so uh, it's the same time uh, here in india so our time zone has been set to india okay so you can do simply set your time zone here in app.php file and then it will change uh, your country time zone and you can uh, just make this change for your website okay and there is the another way to do this like if you don't want to change the global time zone you don't want to change like this you want to keep it utc but you want that uh, for some specific uh, uh, like uh, you just want to change the time zone for users because see this time zone will affect the complete website see orders users and everywhere it will pick the asia Kolkata time zone but if you don't want if you just want for the specific feature of the website if you want to update the time zone for the specific feature of the website or if you want like users will update to this time zone and orders will get updated to this time zone like if your website is such kind of website such kind of big website where uh, you want that one uh, one module is for this country and one module is for this country and one module is for this country so in that three modules there are different time zones so you need uh, you can't set the time zone here then you need to set, set the time zone in in those in the correspondence function in in the function like uh, one is the users module one is the products module one is the orders module for user module there is one country for products there is one country for uh, for users there is one country so 
for every module you are going to set the time zone in their own functions okay so we are going to set the time zone in their own function uh, so i am going to keep it uh, utc only here and i will open like users controller uh, from where we are registering and we are going to make changes in the register user if you want to make the time zone only for the register user i want that uh, utc time zone for the complete website i don't care i just want uh, that uh, for the register user uh, i will i want to update the time zone okay so i am going to update here by default i will uh, use the uh, that uh, date default time zone set function of php to set the time zone so that is simple enough i will do one thing here uh, here uh, see uh, before saving the data uh, i will uh, right here uh, set uh, default uh, time zone to india uh, for users module only for users module only okay and here what i'm going to do i'm going to use one function here date default see it automatically comes here date defi default time zone set this is the function provided by the php and here i'm going to set that the same time zone uh, that we have set earlier asia kolkata okay for our local time zone uh, that time zone we are going to set okay sorry uh, here we can pick once again asia and my time zone is kolkata i'm going to see here it is here asia kolkata so this time zone we are going to set here uh, like this and and after this uh, just simply uh, what we are going to use dollar user uh, so we need to now uh, uh, make the created at created at updated at both we need to update uh, we will use the date function now and date function will automatically update our time zone to the asia kolkata we will use y in caps m uh, d and then for uh, hours minutes and seconds h i s this is the standard format of date time uh, that our mysql database use and along with this credit ad, we also want to set the updated ad as well so i am going to uh, use that for updated at see both the time zone will update to our current time zone that is the asia kolkata okay so let's see now i am going to make the new entry you can see global is now utc but i have updated a here so let's update our current current entry now uh, so one more entry i'm going to do now here let's see uh, i'm going to now register from one more id amit gupta I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, okay, so uh, one more entry. Let's see. Yoofmail.com. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, create your account and uh, see. Okay, there is some mistake. Updated at. Okay, it's updated at. So let's refresh and see now if we able to get that uh, correct. Okay, so let's it register. Uh, status is zero but we don't care about the status see now it's 9 6 a.m so the current time is also that is registered that is 9 6 a.m you can check in the admin panel as well okay so now we can able to update the time zone for the users users module only if you are going to place the order it will still pick the utc time zone okay so you can check in users module uh, here see date time we have not shown the date time here okay so uh, but in but here you can see that uh, it able to update 96 uh, uh, okay 96 am okay so if you will place the new order from this account it will still pick the global time zone because we have not updated uh, that uh, orders function to this time zone and if you want to update it you can simply update uh, in that uh, products controller where from where we are placing the order uh, in place order function or wherever it is it is the checkout function okay and from where we are saving the order and here we need to add these in the same way now just simple enough you just require to copy and paste here and here instead of user just you need to do this thing you need to do like this okay 
so uh, so now see order will get update to your current time zone okay so just this second you are required to do but uh, see best thing is if you want to update the time zone for your complete website then no need to do like this just undo this code okay if you want your website for the complete okay so uh, just just make the change here okay that is enough the time zone is uh, set to asia calcutta for the complete website and that is the best thing to do if you want the complete website time zone update to the uh, update to something specific time zone time zone of your own country with that i am telling you because if in some case you want the different time zone in your website okay so i hope that this is clear to you this you can try at your end and if you have any problem you can surely contact me okay so that's all for now have a nice time goodbye